Research presented the several projects to detect the coronavirus, one in camels and the other in humans, in addition to determining the extent of the spread of the virus in the air. Dr. Mohamed Al Atebi, Kisser, virology and microbiology specialist in the biotechnology program, stressed the need to be cautious, take into account the social distancing, and comply with the directives and instructions to avoid the increase of these cases. More in the following report with Hadil Fahad. Kuwait Institute for Scientific Research is the replay with the qualified and experienced national researchers and scientific technicians from national ready to carry out all the applied researches needed. Kisser presented a project for the early detection of the coronavirus and its spread in the air. The detection of viral uh, loads uh, in the air at uh, closed areas that people uh, expresses either the symptoms by coughing and sneezing or even breathing and these uh, areas uh, can be a potential hazard that the virus itself is sustainable in that areas for a certain time to infect other people and circulating in that area and the impact of high temperatures of the effectiveness of the virus transmission the heat which is in the uh, climate uh, that reaches 20, 30 or 40 degrees, uh, that doesn't do much uh, killing or inactivation of the virus alone. It is joined by the solar radiance, which has the main, which is an uh, effective uh, source of, of uh, viral inactivation. And the heat is uh, adjacent effect. Uh, and that's how, uh, uh, by that temperature, uh, it can kill the virus, uh, you know, in a shorter time with the aid of uh, light. Citizens and residents are requested to take precautions, observe the social distancing and abide by the instructions and guidance to avoid the re-increase of coronavirus infected cases due to contact after re-imposing the partial ban. Reporting to the English News, this is Hadil Fahad.